It's Friday then. It's Saturday, Sunday. What? It's Friday then. Saturday, Sunday. What? Yeah, it's okay. What's up? This is Jeff. Welcome to Jeff's podcast. And before the start of the show, I would like to shout out to Mr. Joby Twyan of Jobs TV Vlogs, wishing you a happy birthday. If you want to know more about his vlog, go check out at youtube.com slash jobs TV. Okay, let's get started with the show. And today, we're talking about Uniqlo UTs. I've been collecting Uniqlo UT started in 2012 and I have a collection on it ranging from anime, cars, comics, and music to fun characters. Uniqlo UT or called it Uniqlo T-shirts started in 2007 where the brand has a cult following for basically everything they sell. From their undershirts to their designer collaborations, their latest beauty collection is to set to break the internet with its sheer scale. It was created by Uniqlo founded in Japan in 1949 as a casual wear company and the brand has been called globally which features fashion collaborations and high-tech wear such as Heat Tech and Airism. For those who know about Uniqlo Heat Tech, the lineup made its appearance in the second episode of Masume Yoshimoto's Komamiko Girl Meets Bear and it's now streaming on News Asia on YouTube where Machi Amayadori wears heat tech after she must go by herself to buy an item from a shop on a faraway location. But the errand proves itself much harder than it seems for her. In May 2012, I was heading out to the Mall of Asia and I saw that Uniqlo is coming to SM Mall of Asia which serves as the first Uniqlo store here in the Philippines and I checked out on display is the collection of Uniqlo UTs ranging from anime, comics, movies, music, and video games. The opening of the Uniqlo store here in the Philippines is scheduled in June 2012 which is also the same date as the ToyCon 2012 event held at the Mega Trade Hall of SM Mega Mall. So I decided to check it out once after the ToyCon weekend. The next weekend, I visited the Uniqlo store and it was jam-packed because the store is popular and UT is also one of the favorites because of the lineup ranging from anime, games, movies, music, and more. I was expecting to buy more UTs but my parents won't accept because the shirt is too thick. Instead, my parents agreed to buy not one but two UTs. And my first UT collection is the Test Type 01 shirt from Evangelion and the last shooting shirt from Gundam. It's been 9 years that I collected Uniqlo UTs that I'm borrowing it and use it for weekend trips and also heading out to the conventions, ranging from anime to car conventions. I've been wearing Uniqlo UTs every weekend, ranging from heading out to the movies while I'm wearing Star Wars and Marvel UTs, or attending anime, game, and car conventions such as Masashi Kishimoto's Naruto, featuring Kakashi UTs, Ken Akamatsu's Negima UTs, Konami's Metal Gear UTs, and the brand's Cars UTs such as the Ford Mustang. I'm also wearing casual including Asian brands such as the San Miguel Beer UTs, Wiki Sports UTs, and even artist collaborations such as Pharrell Williams' I Am Other, Jason Poland, and Kenshi Yonesu. For those who know, Pharrell Williams founded I Am Other, where he is a singer and songwriter, record producer, fashion designer, and entrepreneur, while Kenshi Yonesu is a Japanese musician, singer and songwriter, record producer, and illustrator, and artist Jason Poland is an American artist where he famous for drawing the city life around New York City. I draw the image of the Moa Globe pays homage to the late Jason Poland, where my friends posted a photo of Moa Globe which is the Moa memes, because they will attend an anime convention and they are poking fun on it. My friends called it on the way to Moa. 
I checked out around unique to stores ranging from SM malls such as SM Bacoor, SM Mall of Asia, SM Makati and SM Mega Mall to non-SM stores such as Glorieta 5. Glorieta 5 is the largest Uniqlo flagship store in the Philippines. Go check it out in Glorieta 5 branch. Uniqlo UTs is my special wear that I'm going to wear it whenever I go. Whether on casual Fridays or heading out to the weekend, still it's a fun to wear it. The UTs is cheaper which is cost about 590 to 790 Philippine pesos or 12 to 16 US dollars while in Japan it costs about 790 to 990 yen or 350 to 400 Philippine pesos. But it's worth to wear it. The upcoming UTs as seen on the official website of Uniqlo ranging from League of Legends and Ultraman to Godzilla vs Kong and Animal Crossing and many more UTs. Kids and adults wear UTs, so it is time to work and play during free time. If you have comments or suggestions, let us know in the comments. Follow Jeff11 Manchester on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Subscribe on YouTube at youtube.com slash and send an email to jeff11lfs at gmail.com for PayPal or Gcash if you're in the Philippines and other countries. Well, that's about it for Jeff's podcast. This is Jeff. We'll see you in the next podcast.